Drawing Layla by Meg Ellison. At school, Layla is super smart and loves everything to do with science. She stays under the radar, she tries not to be noticed, except by a few mean girls who bully her. At home, Layla takes care of her younger brother, Andy. They do their best to stay clear of their unstable mother. They live in a filthy, water-damaged apartment with mold and larva in every corner. Their mom can't take care of them. Layla makes sure that nobody ever sees the place where they live. When Layla's science teacher assigns a project that includes a video submission of a biome, Layla chooses her own toxic home and videotapes the indoor fungi, the black mold, the organisms living in the broken fridge. This short book packs a huge emotional punch and is most certainly not for the faint of heart. The descriptions of Layla's situation and living conditions are at times stomach churning and heart wrenching, but unfortunately, completely realistic. Layla is a wonderful character. She's smart, witty, strong, and determined. It is impossible not to root for her as you read. And while the ending to her story may not be a neat and happy one, it is in perfect keeping with the rest of the book. This book is a great read for fans of The Benefits of Being an Octopus by Anne Braden or Free Lunch by Rex, Rex Ogle.